Hi, hi. Good evening. Good evening sa inyo. Good evening. Can you hear me? Narinig nyo ba ako? Hi, Nemi. Yan. So, please do ano, uh, comment sa section dyan. No? Uh, comment anything kung from where you are right now, kung nasang lugar ka, Quezon City ba, uh, if you're on uh, OFW, kung sang lugar ka. No? So, please do comment dyan. No? Para at least mabati ko kayo at the same time para malaman ko na nandyan kayo. And also, no, uh, please do share this video kasi very valuable yung magiging topic natin ngayon. And gusto natin ma-share. And kumbaga, um, share the love, share the learnings. no. So please do share this video para at least malaman ko na nandyan ka. Okay? Yan. So, yan. From Sandra from Cebu. No? Thank you. Thank you, Sandra. Nandyan ka. Okay, so Miss Nemi nandiyan. I think from Taytay si Miss Nemi, no? And yan. Okay. So guys, no, share lang. Share lang ng video. Okay. Yan lang. Uh, bati lang tayo. Let's wait for others to come in. No? Share lang natin yung natin kung... Kamusta kayo? Kamusta ang inyong araw? So again guys, please ano uh, mag-heart side kayo dyan. Yun, from, uh, yan. Hi. From Jerusalem, si Rock. Wow. No? From Jerusalem, si, si Rock. No? So tignan natin. Share lang natin guys. Ha? Yan. So sinishare na natin. Parang yung iba. Kasi di ba usually it's Friday and Saturday yung Uh, money wise natin no so this is the first time that it's tuesday okay so from si Denek from japan no si lorna from uh yeah si i think si lorna si mom lorna from batangas ba o laguna okay so si jose nandyan si rap okay keep it coming no so tapos paano na pa heart side no para malaman ko na nandyan kayo Okay, si Raymond from Leyte. Okay, so, yan. Ayos, so dumadami na tayo. Okay, so basically, no, um, yan. So, ang topic natin ngayon actually is about, no, ano ba yung mga top problems ng mga Pilipino, bakit di sila makapag-ipon? So, basically, no, I, you know, my blog, ano, I've been blogging, I've built, Uh, some of you are my subscribers sa blog ko, sa emails, uh, email uh, sequence ko, no, sa email uh, letter, newsletter ko. And, um, and I did a survey. No? Siguro kasama ka doon kung nanonood ka ngayon. No? I, I did a survey and tinanong ko sila kasi no, previously sinabi, sinabi nila sa akin, Sir Lauren, hindi ako makapag-invest. No? Hindi ako makapag, uh, you know, hindi ako makapag- uh, kuha ng insurance no hindi ako makapag um, kuha ng hindi ako makabuo ng emergency fund no so basically ang sabi nila sa akin their top two problems no actually is they don't have enough savings wala talaga silang or iba hindi talaga makapag-ipon at yung isa baon nga sa utang and tinanong ko sila no bakit bakit kayo baon sa utang at uh, bakit bakit kayo baon sa utang at wala kayong naiipon no So, yun yung magiging topic natin ngayon. And uh, when I aggregated it, no, kumbaga parang uh, ginawa ko, pinagsama-sama ko yung mga sakot kasi ang dami. No? I think it's three, around 300 yung nag-email sa akin. Uh, doon sa form din, mga nag-reply, ang dami, around 200 to 300. And I was shocked, no? Kasi nung, nung pinagsama-sama ko niya, six, six top, kumbaga six uh, major Uh, reasons talaga why why they do, don't have savings and bakit sila baon sa utang okay so hi Gian nandiyan na si Gian si Feli hi Feli yan so from Pasig hi Jed from Abu Dhabi wow OFW Bayani si Sir Raymondo From Leyte, okay. Yan, so. Okay, so let's start, no? Um, again, 
Ang topic natin ngayon is the top six reasons why Filipinos cannot save or bakit sila baon sa utang. Okay? The first reason nung sinabi nila sa akin is they, they have too many or high expenses. Ang sabi sabi niya, ang dami daw, ano, ang dami nilang... Ang dami nilang ano, ang dami nilang gastusin talaga no, hindi nila hindi nila ma bayaran no, hindi nila ma hindi mag-cope up yung income nila sa kanila expenses. Okay? So paano ako makapag-save Sir Lauren? Paano ako makabayad sa utang ko? No, paano ako makakapag-invest no kung ang dami kong pinabayaran no? Too many or high expenses. No? So, kung mga daming bills na binabayaran. Okay? So actually the first no reason kumbaga parang this is the first reason nga no bakit hindi sila makapag-ipon. And there are many kumbaga there are many factors no bakit ang da- laki ng expenses mo. Of course first is impulse buying no hindi mo makontrol yung sarili mo. So diyan dito yung sa aspect na talagang dami mong kumbaga pag na- napunta ka lang sa isang mall na padaan ka lang, bili ka na agad without having a budget. So it's, it's important no pag may bibiling ka dapat nakaplan yan. Hindi yung pag nakita mo lang no. Uh, and one more tip no pag nag-grocery ka, sabi ko nga uh, ginagawa namin ng wife ko, pag mag-grocery kami dapat hindi hindi ka gutom no kasi pag gutom ka you tend to buy more no. So that's one tip din no. So dapat pag mag-grocery ka dapat busog ka para at least kasi di ba ang tendency kasi pag gutom ka tapos pag nag-grocery ka, ang dami mong yung mga food, mga chacheria or anything, tinapay, ang dami mo nabibili kasi in your mind, you're hungry. ba? Diba? So that's one tip. And of course, impulse buying. No? Dapat, again, pag bibili ka, minor purchases, pag balikan mo, pag isipan mo, it's, and it's, it should be within the budget. Same thing with major expenses. No? Dapat talaga, um, dapat pag nagbabudget ka, no, yung mga major expenses, kasama yan doon. Okay? And of course, no, Again, the, dito, dito pa lang tayo sa problem number one, no? Too many or high expenses and too many bills talaga, no? Kaya hindi makapag-ipon. The, again, sabi ko kanina, one problem of having high expenses and bills is impulse buying and you cannot control your spending, okay? So again, how to solve that, have a budget, no? Um, kailangan pinagpaplanuan lahat, okay? Second, wants versus needs. So, Kumbaga parang i-classify mo ano ba yung needs mo sa kawans. So kailangan ba? Siyempre yung mga needs natin, yung pagkain, pambayad sa kuryente. No? So yung wants ba, kailangan ba araw-araw mag, or every other day magsine? Kailangan ba sa mamahalik kape? So these are wants no, na hindi naman necessities. But wants talaga, gusto lang natin. Okay? So classify mo, baka pwede mong bawasan yung wants mo. Okay? So iba... So another tip din dapat pag nagka-travel ka it should be budgeted it should be within the budget no so iba kasi sa atin diba travel na utang later so mahirap talaga yun okay so of course yolo nandiyan yan diba sinasabi na iba dami, gastos lang ako diba I only live once no so paano pag <laughs> diba paano pag nag uh, tumanda ka Paano yung retirement mo and paano yung mga responsibility mo sa pamilya mo? No? So, yes, we want that have YOLO responsibility, uh, mindset rather. But of course, yung responsibility natin no, to, to prepare for retirement and to provide for our family. Okay? So, kailangan i-balance na. Let's, you know, finding the right balance between YOLO and talagang preparing for our future. Okay? So, nandyan din bakit mataas yung Uh, expenses natin is yung instant reward or gratification no kumbaga pag minsan pag um, feeling natin if we did it, parang hard work talaga na buong araw na pagod tayo ang tendency kagastos ka di ba to to reward yourself parang yun yung ano natin eh reason natin but tayo gumagastos but alam mo there are many things in life na hindi naman kailangan bumili pa para maging masaya like um, just being with your family with your children di ba It's it's a reward na rin, di ba? So, hindi kailangan gumastos just to reward yourself. Okay? So, again, so yan. Kaya nangyayari, no? Um, sobrang laki na expenses. Kaya yun yung unang problema. Dun sa, yan yung unang lumitaw dun sa survey na ginawa ko, no? So, that's having too many high expenses and too many bills. 
Okay? And of course, nandiyan din yung lifestyle inflation na tinatawag na pag-tendency ang mga tao, pag tumaas yung sweldo, no? tumataas din yung expenses nila. So, dapat hindi ganun, no? And pag tumaas yung income natin, dapat, no, yung bantayan natin yung expenses natin. It should be, somehow, yes, we could we could buy uh, better things, but at the same time, we must check talaga, baka mamaya, no, ang tendency tumaas, mas, mas mabilis yung inflation nung lifestyle expense mo kaysa sa income mo. Which in turn, no, talagang wala ka may ipon at mababawon ka sa utang. Okay, so that's number one, too many high, uh, too many expenses, no, very high bills, no, kaya hindi sila, kaya daw hindi sila makapag-ipon. Oh, so, diniscuss ko, di ba, sa inyo yung pinaka reasons, no, kumbaga, ano pa yung mga solusyon na pwedeng gawin doon. Okay, second problem na sinabi nila sa akin is yun nga yung mga unexpected expenses. Okay, so may nagkasakit, kailangan magbigay dito, may namatayan, kailangan magbigay, no, may mga... May mga kasal na kailangan magregalo, no, na may mga binyag na kailangan magpa uh, kimkim, no, yung mga ganun. So, tapos sasabihin ni iba, may sale. Eh. So, di ba, unexpected expenses 'yan. So, basically, um, so how can we combat this yung mga biglang may nagkasakit, di ba? Uh, paano natin mapapag-prepare for that? Okay, of course, if Kunyari, sabihin natin yung may magkasakit, kailangan talaga may healthcare plan. No? Kung meron ka pang, kung kaya naman talaga, muro lang naman po yung mga healthcare plan, di ba? So, mas maganda, para pag may magkasakit, no, merong tutulong. Kung maga, ito yung magiging uh, kagastos, no, in case na may magkasakit. So, yan. Um, tapos, um, events and occasions naman. Paano pag may event, may kasal, ganyan? may mga binyag. So, kailangan nasa budget po yan. So, kami, what we usually do, monthly, meron kami yung budget for for events, no? Yung mga unexpected. So, dapat binabudget po yan. Hindi yan unexpected kasi, di ba, usually pagkasal, alam mo na yan kung kailan, di ba? Pag binyag, tinasabihan ka rin. So, it should be, it should form part of your budget, monthly budget. Okay? So, third, sasabihin ni ba, unexpected expenses, mga emergencies. So, dapat meron kang emergency fund no it's 3 to 6 worth of your monthly income so let's say if you're earning 20,000 times 6 no 120 or times 3 you have 60,000 you, sh- you should have that emergency fund so easily accessible pwede mong kunin anytime emergency fund okay so um and of course yung Kaya may mga unexpected expenses pa, kaya nila sinasabi yun. No? Tinanong ko sila, ano pa ba yung mga unexpected expenses nyo? Sabi nila, pag may sale daw. No? So, yun ang hirap sa ating mga Pilipino, di ba? So, pag may sale, kahit wala sa budget, bili ng bili. Pagdating sa bahay, hindi naman gagabitin, matatambak lang. So, dapat bilin mo. Kung ako nga, bumibili talaga ako kahit hindi sale. Basta kailangan ko. Dapat kailangan mo talaga. Hindi yung... Pag may sale, bili agad. Okay? Usually, matatambak lang yan sa, sa bahay nyo. Diba? Hindi mo naman nagagamit. Okay? So, third is support your... Fa- uh, third reason, no? Ba't sila makapag-ipon? Again, just to recap, first reason daw is too many or high bills. Second is unexpected expenses. Problem three na sinasabi nila is... Kaya, kaya, ba, kaya hindi sila makaipon is they need to support their family daw. No? So yung mga tinatawag na especially for the sandwich generation that they need to support their children and their parents. Kaya sandwich, no? sandwich generation. No? Yung iba sinasabi sa akin, Sir Lauren, may pinag-aaral kasi akong kapatid. No? Uh, meron na akong uh, pinag-aaral na pamangkin, na anak ng pinsang ko, di ba? So basically yun eh. Yun lagi yung reason bakit no, wala ka talaga may ipon. You, you support for family. Okay, so again, there's nothing wrong with it, but as long as it's within your budget, no, siyempre dapat unahin mo muna yung sarili mo. No, how can you give to some to someone na wala ka naman? So you have to save first para sa sarili mo. And then, kung may excess, no, bigay ka talaga. Or kung gusto mo talaga magbigay, you have to increase your income or lower your expenses. Pero in, doesn't, uh, it, hindi siya valid reason. No? I mean, supporting family is good. But it's not a valid reason for you not to save for yourself. 
Okay, the end of the day, you cannot give what you do not have. Kung ikaw maubos ka, pag nag may nangyari sa'yo, kaka, puro ka suporta sa family mo. Pag may nangyari sa'yo, tapos nabawin ka sa utang, mas lalo kang hindi makakapag-support sa family mo. So you have to choose yourself somehow first. no? And of course, the fourth reason na sinasabi nila na no, bakit sila makapag-ipon is low income. Ang late down ng sweldo nila. No, bakit? Sir Laurent, hindi nga ako ma- hindi nga mag-cash eh. So, ah, sobrang liit ng sweldo ko. Hindi ta- hindi ako ma- kaya hindi ako makaipon, no? So, sapat lang, no, pagdating ng uh, alam niyo yung pecha de peligro, 'di ba? Yung pecha de peligro daw, no? The week before payroll, no? So, kumbaga yung tag nilang pecha de peligro. Okay, so ubos na daw agad, no? Tapos wala akong ibang sources ng income and Uh, what's the solution for this having a low income no there's two way to increase that excess or that income no it's either you reduce your expenses para mas malaki yung income na masave mo no lita mo expenses mo no and dinis ka natin kanina ang daming tips doon how to reduce your income i reduce your expenses rather and then the second uh, way to increase income is to increase income no get another job no or have a sideline no and kami uh, shameless plug lang no sa ascending life we have this hustler course no 12 different courses 12 different um co- coaches na different fields no tuturuan ka magkaroon ng extra income no so ako just to share you uh yung story ko no when i'm uh, uh, working pa sa isang government no uh, agency as a CPA no um After noon, talagang naghahanap pa ako ng side line. Meron akong nagtuturo ako about financial literacy. No, after office, pupunta ako sa Makati, magtuturo ako doon. No, uh, magbibenta ako mga financial products, mga investments, ganyan. So, pag weekend, ganun din. So, naghahanap ako, tapos nag, uh, nag-earn ako through online. No, affiliate marketing, selling digital products. No, All of them, ginagawa ko yung kahit may day job ako. No, so... Uh, kung talagang gusto mo, may paraan. No, walang excuse po na sabi mo sa akin, I have no time earning income at the side, no. If there's kung gusto mo po talaga, no, ako that time talagang after office, 6 o'clock, punta pa ako sa Makati, kausap ng kliyente, mag magano mag magbebenta ako kung ano yung pwede. Tapos pag weekend, pag Saturday nasa wala, hindi ako nasa bahay, nagkakailata, nanonood doon kung ano-ano. Talagang nag, naghahanap ako ng pagkakitaan that time. Because I need to increase my income. No? So, for me, it's not a reason, it's not, not a reason na sabi mo na wala akong mahanap na income. Ang dami pong opportunities nowadays. No? And again, doon sa ascending life, yung 12 different fields, different coaches, no? Tinuturo doon how to have a side income, no? How to earn digital business, how to earn online, dropshipping, how to be a freelance, a freelancer and free, earn dollars from it. So marami, maraming ways and you cannot, hindi mo pwedeng sabihin sa akin na walang way to earn additional income. Marami pong paraan, even online. Okay? So let's go to f- number five. This is the fifth reason No, bakit daw hindi sila makapag-ipon? No, again, this is based on the around 300 respondents on my, on my uh, survey no, sa aking mga subscribers. Okay? So, the fifth reason is financial literacy. They don't know. Wala talaga silang alam about uh, handling money. You know, we cannot blame them. We cannot blame us. No? Kasi sa bahay pa lang, di ba? Wala namang talagang hindi tinuturo to, di ba? Yung mga parents natin, hindi tayo tinuturo na about handling money, no? Sa pagdating mo sa skwela, wala nang tuturo, no? Puro academics yung tinuturo, no? About history, no? Wala nang tuturo about uh, investments, about managing your money, about budgeting, no? So, nakakalungkot. So, there's no proper manage management, kaya hindi sila makapag-ipon daw, hindi nila alam, no? Na dapat pala mag-ipon, ano ba importansya ng pag-iipon? No? So, that's uh, financial illiteracy. Kung baga, walang tamang financial education. Okay? So, I believe, di ba, lahat tayo, sa hopefully, no, um, there's a move by Banko Central and hopefully, ma-integrate ang financial education sa ating academic system. So, hopefully, sana malapit na yan. Okay? 
So, that's the fifth reason, financial literacy wala talaga. Kaya, hindi sila, kaya daw hindi sila makapag-ipon. Okay? And the, the last reason for now, ang sabi nila sa akin, no? but hindi sila makapag-ipon, hindi sila makapag- uh, t- talagang hindi sila makapag-start mag-save, no? is because of debts. Ang dami daw nilang utang. Okay? Iba, nakasanla yung ATM, no ang daming credit card um ang daming credit card debts no ang daming mortgages no loans no and ano ba bakit ba ganun kasi it's very easy for us nowadays to to ano eh di ba to get credit cards and uh, just to give you an idea no if you cannot pay your credit card debt it will double your outstanding balance will double in less than a year or one point one and a half uh, years no So, you see, kasi ang interest ng credit cards around, di ba, 3.5 to 4 percent, no? Imagine 40 percent a year ang interest pag di mo nabayaran yung outstanding mo. Ru- using the rule of 72, your, let's say if you have a loan sa credit card mo na around 50,000, it will be 100,000, no? If di mo lang siya nabayaran more than a year. So, ganun po katindi ang credit card. Okay? Again, I'm not Uh, telling naman na don't use credit card, but it should be within your budget. You should have control over your credit card. Okay? So, marami pong ways to eliminate debt. May mas noble method. May mga paraan. But first, you have to stop the bleeding. No, ano ibig sabihin nun? Ibig sabihin, uh, kahit na mamanage mo yung debt mo, ma-eliminate mo, pero yung habits mo pa rin, no? spending habits mo, ano ba yung root cause? Ba't ka nabaon sa utang? Ang dami mo bang gastos? Uh, hindi mo talaga makontrol yung paggasos mo. So, find the root cause. Yun muna yung solusyonan mo. Okay? And of course, mortgages and loans, no? If yung kotse kasi, if you could buy it in cash, mas maganda sa bahay naman. Kung, kung talagang gustong-gusto nyo nang bumili, no? Nang mag-asawa, dapat pagpalanuan nyo. Mortgage payment should be 30%. It should not go beyond 30% of your income. Okay, so let's say if you're earning 100,000 a month, your mortgage payment should be below 30,000. So that's another tip, no? So pag gumagawa kami ng financial plan, dapat yung mortgage payment mo should be or you should not exceed 30% of your gross income. Okay? So basically, you know, so just recap lang, uh, ano ulit yung top six problems, but hindi daw makapag-ipon yung mga Pinoy, no? And I'm speaking of, uh, kumbaga, this is, respondents from the 300 no, subscribers of mine and tingin ko ganito rin talaga no, ang problema ng mga Pinoy ba't di sila makapag-ipon again just to recap first is un- too many or high bills no, high expenses second yung mga unexpected expenses daw kaya hindi sila makapag-ipon third is they have to support their family fourth is um, long in- uh, low income wala daw hindi sapat yung income nila Fifth is a uh, financial illiteracy, illiteracy no or walang proper financial education. And six, no talagang baon sa utang at the start talaga. So hindi sila makapag-ipon. Okay? Game some, some tips, more tips no on how to eliminate your debt, avoid credit card as much as possible, no life check your lifestyle inflation, no para mamaya mas mataas na yung pag-inflate ng no, expenses mo, pagtaas ng expenses mo, lifestyle mo kaysa sa income mo, talaga magiging negative ka dyan at wala ka may ipon. Okay? Live below your means, not within your means, below. No? Kailangan. Great. Check your budget, create your monthly income statement, no? Profit and loss support. Tignan mo, dapat mas mababa yung expenses mo sa income mo. Stay away from materialism and be financially literate. No? Ganun ka importante. No? Be, be financially literate. Okay? So... Yan. So, thank you. Uh, hello. So, guys, may questions ba kayo? No? Kung nandyan kayo, please pusuan nyo naman to. No? Pusuan nyo naman yung video para malaman ko na nandyan kayo. And please do hi dyan sa comment section para mabasa ko yung mga kunasan kayo. At the same time, um, please do share this video para mas marami pa tayong mabless. No? Mar- ang ganda ng topic natin. And, um, yan. Yun, thank you, uh, Alexi, no? Very attentive. Six reasons, no? Yan. Yun, yun yung topic ko ngayon. Okay, galing. 
Uh, high donor, grabe, daming books. Yes, so I love to read. Yan, so sabi ni Teng, I'm watching from UAE. Si Rod, hi Rod, thank you for watching. Alexi, good evening. Agrippino, thank you po, nandyan kayo. Si Ms. Pat, thank you. Um, Lerma, hi Gid, good evening. Yan. Uh, hi John, Gian, Nelly, Daisy, Nolly, si Teng, yan, si Emmeline from Dubai, wow, si Jong from Dubai, thank you guys, thank you guys for being with me. So uh, guys, may questions ba kayo regarding, um, regarding ano, uh, Raymond from Leyte, Brian Limindo, yes, mamaya pa-flash ko yung ano, I have a website na no? i-flash ko mamaya. Bibigyan ko kayong regalo. If you stay until the end no of this uh, show no, I will give you a gift. No? So uh, more materials sa like ebook tsaka yung mga training bibigyan ko kayo for free. Okay? From Leyte. Hello, hello. Hi uh Ahmed. Hi, kamusta? Um Hi Lynn from Kuala Lumpur, Malaysia. More power din sa inyo. Ingat po kayo dyan. John, John, I'm watching. Yan. Thank you for tonight. Yan. Thank you, thank you, thank you guys for being with us. No, So, being with me pala. Okay? So, may questions ba kayo guys regarding um, our topic, savings, about getting out of debt? No, So, may questions ba kayo? Para at least masagot ko na while we're... Uh, Thank you guys. No? So, ang dami natin, around 46 to 50 persons watching live. Okay? So, baka may questions kayo dyan para at least um, masagutan natin. So, post nyo lang dyan, no? Uh, Hi, Kim from Riyadh. Okay, for the meantime, no? Um, this is my gift for you. This is a uh, free ebook. So, siguro, if you're following my page and if you're into my email uh, newsletter, no? Um, siguro na alam niyo na tong free ebook na to, no? So I'm giving this free ebook for free. This is a 50 page ebook, no? Na uh, Wise Pinoy, may ipon para sa future at walang utang. Okay? So this is a free ebook na. Okay? So uh kaka-release lang siya kahapon, I think. Oh yes, yesterday we just uh launched it and this is for free. Grabe, 50 page po 'yan. Very content rich, no? So, and we are giving away uh, this free ebook. All you have to do is just go to bit.ly slash ascend free ebook. Capital A F E Puyan. Okay? So, just go to that uh, website and download this ebook. Again, bit.ly slash ascend free ebook. Okay? Capital A-F-E. Okay? So, punta lang po kayo dyan at para ma-download niyo yung e-book yan. And in, in addition to that, no, meron tayong free video training series. No, This is one hour training. No, uh, Hinati natin sa tatlo, 20, around 20 minutes each video. This is a three-part video series. All in all, that's one hour. Okay? So, just go to um just go to bit.ly no slash ascend free video training okay so basically yan punta lang kayo dyan. this is free no walang bayad po yan bit.ly slash ascend free video training capital a f v t no yung as yung ascend free free video training so yeah all you have to do is go there no and nilagay ko rin yung link no dito sa caption dito sa dito sa may description ng vid Facebook live na to so pwede niyo uh, tignan doon sa taas no makita mo yung mga link diyan okay yan so basically yun and of course um i'm inviting you guys if you really want to take it to the next level no we have prepared the ascending life savers course okay so Mamaya yung mga questions nyo, sasagutin ko yan. So, I just want a few minutes of your time to watch this presentation. 
Okay. Bukon ka na ba sa utang at walang ipon? Pwede kita tulungan para makawala sa pagkakautang at makapag-ipon. Tignan mo itong mga ilang mensahe sa amin. Ito si Lisa, isa sa mga estudyante namin, at si Ralph naman, isa rin sa mga estudyante namin. Ngayon, tatanong kita ulit, baon ka na ba sa buhay financial mo? Walang ipon, baon sa utang, at walang direksyon. Kahit may sweldo at trabaho, hindi pa rin sapat. At hindi lang ikaw ang nag-iisa. Ayon sa Bangko Sentral, 1 out of 4 lang ng mga Pilipino ang may ipon. Yan ang masakit na katotohanan. Karamihan talaga ng Pilipino ay walang ipon. Nagtrabaho, nagpagod, walang ipon. Ang masakit pa, baon sa utang. Hindi mo naman kasalanan talaga ito. Okay, hindi daw makita yung video. Yan, yan. Ulitin natin, Aldi. Okay, sige, sige. Yan, can you see? Yan, can you see? Ulitin natin, ha? Pakisabi nila kung nakikita niyo, okay? Baon ka na ba sa utang at walang ipon? Pwede kita tulungan para makawala sa pagkakautang at makapag-ipon. Tignan mo itong mga ilang mensahe sa amin. Ito si Lisa, isa sa mga estudyante namin, at si Ralph naman, isa rin sa mga estudyante namin. Ngayon, tatanong kita ulit, Baon ka na ba sa buhay pinansyal mo? Walang ipon, baon sa utang, at walang direksyon. Kahit may sweldo at trabaho, hindi pa rin sapat. At hindi lang ikaw ang nag-iisa. Ayon sa Bangko Sentral, 1 out of 4 lang ng mga Pilipino ang may ipon. Yan ang masakit na katotohanan. Karamihan talaga ng Pilipino ay walang ipon. Nagtrabaho, nagpagod, walang ipon. Ang masakit pa, baon sa utang. Hindi mo naman kasalanan talaga ito. Sobrang mahal na mga bilihin, maliit ang sahod, ang daming gastusin. So ano ang problema ba talaga? Wrong money mindset, wrong money beliefs, wrong money practices, and no money coach. So ano ang dapat mong gawin kung talagang gusto mo makapag-ipon at makapag-ahon sa utang? Meron ba talagang paraan or sistema para makaahon sa utang at makapag-ipon? Meron. Yan ang rason bakit ginawa ko tong video na ito. Introducing the Ascending Life Savers Course. Isang programa na ginawa namin para sa ordinaryong Pilipino para makaahon sa utang at makapag-start mag-ipon. Si Juan na baon sa utang at walang ipon na naging si Juan na may control sa kanyang buhay pinansyal at walang utang at may ipon. Kayang-kaya mo ito. At ano ba ang kailangan mo? Ito ang kailangan mo, the Ascending Life Savers Program. In Ascending Life, we have thousands of Filipinos save and invest, get out of debt, and take charge of their financial lives. At ito rin ang lagi namin narinig na hinaing. Wala talaga silang ipon at baon talaga sa utang. Kaya gumawa kami ng epektibong programa para masolusyonan ito. Nag-research kami at kinonsulta din namin ang mga kapwa naming financial experts patungkol dito at hiningi namin ang kanilang opinion para mabuo ang programa na ito. Pagkatapos, we came up with a very effective, easy and proven methods to help ordinary Filipinos to get out of debt and start saving money. And we also incorporated all our best practices in this field. Ano ba ang naman ng Savers Program? Six steps to effectively build your savings and change your money mindset. Valued at 10,000 pesos. Your relationship with debt and loans video course valued at 10,000 pesos. Debt and loans management and elimination 101 video course valued at 10,000 pesos. Creating a budget and emergency fund and managing debts video course valued at 10,000 pesos. Hindi lang dyan. Meron tayong 50 practical ipon hacks video course valued at 10,000 pesos also. 30-day quick money saving challenge plan valued at 5,000 pesos. Savings pledge certificate valued at 2,000 pesos. 
10, 20, 30, 40 savings and budgeting rule worksheet valued at 5,000 pesos, road to 500,000 savings plan worksheet valued at 5,000 pesos, and the 52-week savings challenge worksheet valued at 5,000 pesos. Hindi lang yan, magkakaroon ka rin ng wise Pinoy may ipon para sa future, walang utang ibo, valued at 5,000 pesos. One-on-one -on -one coaching sessions with a financial coach valued at 20,000 pesos. And this, of course, the Savers Level Certificate of Completion valued at 2,000 pesos. And lastly, magkakaroon ka rin ng possibility and potentially earn ng 500, 1,500, 4,000, 10,000 pesos or 18,000 pesos or even 30,000 pesos daily using the Ascending Life Affiliate Program valued at 10,000 pesos. So, how much are the college education and financial-related postgraduate courses nowadays? Maybe 100,000 or even millions of pesos. Also, how much would you have to pay to hire a consult, a legitimate and biased financial advisor or coach for a lifetime? This will easily cost you 100,000 pesos. Pero magkano nga ba ang enrollment investment fee for the Ascending Life Savers program or course? 50,000 nga ba? 20,000 nga ba? Or 10,000? So, to lang, we could easily charge you that amount considering the transformation you will receive when you follow the program. Pero gusto talaga namin na matulungan ka. We wanted to pay it forward. Ginawa namin itong very, very affordable for you. Katumbas lang ng dalawang cinema tickets o di kaya libang mamahaling kape, baka nga mas mahal pa ang gamit mong cellphone ngayon. Okay? All these benefits and courses plus the one-on-one -on -one coaching session are only 980 pesos. Yes, you read it right. The Savers course and program is only 980 pesos. It's a one-time payment. Okay? Again, these benefits would easily be valued at 109,000 pesos and we're giving it away at such an insanely low price because we want to help you and we want to help you right now. Just click the button below and you will be debt-free and start saving money. And in case you're wondering, yes, there's a guarantee. In all our trainings and courses and programs have a 15-day money-back guarantee. So in other words, if you're not happy for any reason, just let us know and we'll give you your money back. You either get the results you want or you get your money back. It's as simple as that. Alam ko naman na hindi ka magre-refund kasi we firmly believe that this will really transform you. And ganun kami ka-confident sa program na ito. Kaya we offer a money-back guarantee. But do it now because this promo price will go up very, very soon. And we have limited slots because we have limited coaches for the one-on-one -on -one coaching. Okay, this is your last chance. Click the button below and let's get started. Pero ano nga ba ang sinasabi ng iba sa programa na ito? Ito sa mga students natin, isang OFW. Ito naman isa rin OFW from Saudi Arabia. And si Ms. Maria Luisa, isa rin OFW who already took this program. Isa pang bonus para sa'yo. Pag nag ka today, yes, just for today, you will get these extra bonuses. Again, just for today, for taking action fast, Expense Tracker Worksheet, Saving Goals Tracker Worksheet, Debt Elimination Snowball Worksheet, Other Financial Materials and Worksheets. Again, if you just enroll today, you will get these bonuses. Change your financial life now. Click the button below and see you inside. Okay, guys. Yeah. So, any more questions pa kasi? Kayo. So I hope no um I hope you do join us, enroll no, and again there's no risk for you. Kung ayaw mo, we could return your money back. Okay. You just have to go to yeah, so if you have questions, yeah, and actually mas mahal pa yung cellphone nyo, sapatos nyo, no, dun sa enrollment. Okay. So all you have to do, guys, now if you really want to avail those bonuses right now, and, and yeah, we have limited slots because we have limited coaches right now, and baka in promo then surprise, no? Baka magtaas din kami as uh, very soon. So 
if you're if you, if you have that 980 pesos no talagang uh, gusto mo magbago yung buhay mo gusto mo talagang may mangyari sa buhay financial mo is i really invite you to enroll no so all you have to do is go to bit.ly slash ascend savers no that's capital a and s all are small letters no bit.ly slash capital a no ascend capital s savers okay so paano magbayad sabi ni um yan so so paano magbayad sabi ni Uh, Alexi, uh, I'll be the main coach, no? But maraming financial coach right now. So actually, we're training more coaches kasi medyo limited lang and may mga sumali na. Currently, we are, we have around 200, no? Na i-coach, no? 200 students, no? So, yan. Pero mga galing po yung mga coaches natin. The coach are recorded and you you will rate them, no? If you have problems with them, No? Sabi ni Brian, paano po magbayad, sir? All you have to do is go to that link, bit.ly slash ascendsavers, and you can pay marami options via Cebuana kasi partner natin yung Dragon Pay, no? So, ginagamit ng mga government agencies and big uh, companies din, no? Like Shopee, they use Dragon Pay, no? So, yan. Uh, you can pay through bank online, bank deposits, online transfers, through Cebuana, yung mga ganun, or credit card, PayPal. So, almost lahat ng payment facility pwede kayong magbayad through uh, just to enroll in this Ascend Savers. No? So, again, go to bit.ly slash Ascend Savers. And for today, no, I think until, siguro, until, uh, siguro, just for today, siguro, no, you, you'll get those bonuses. Yung mga, if you have a debt, do, debt uh, snowball worksheet, dumililista yung um yung utang mo, paano mo siya ma-eliminate, no? gumawa kami ng uh, template for that. Meron din tayong expense tracker, doon mo yung susulat lahat na expense mo. And other worksheets, no? those bonuses, if you act now, no? kung ngayon mag-enroll ka, you will get those bonuses. Okay? And uh, yun nga, no? that's one thing, that's one bonus na pwede mo wala if you delayed your action. The second is, again, Uh, we do not know until when namin i-close to kasi we have limited coaches. Kasi pag nag-enroll ka nga, you have one-on-one coaching, live coaching. no. So again, because we have limited time, kasi tao din kami. No? So that's one of the um, that's one of the benefits. Okay? So sabi ni Alexi, how long would be the course? So it it's uh, dependent on you. no. Yung course kasi naka, ando na lahat yan. You just have to follow it depending on your availability. But the coaching, no, magpapaschedule ka. Mamimili ka ng schedule and then dapat magmatch dun sa coach. no. So, mag adjust naman yung coach para sa'yo. Okay? So, Leonora, is sir, af- affiliate marketing po ba yan? Uh, may, mayroon tayong affiliate program, but that's not our main product. Our main product is the program itself, no? will teach you how to get started with uh, your finances get out of debt no start your savings no 50 ipon hacks and dami natin ibibigay doon no and we have an uh, affiliate program just like Lazada just like Amazon they do have affiliate programs no Grab no uh, Airbnb they have affiliate programs so pa tayo meron din okay so where would be the location it's all online including the coaching it's a online call no pati yung mga programs pati yung mga worksheets downloadable so you don't have to go anywhere you can access it anywhere anytime okay yan main products yes financial management sir ka open ko lang hindi ko naabutan sir uh, if you want you can go to bit.ly no open a tab Go to Ascend Savers. So again, we have limited slots and the bonuses is just for today. Okay? Uh, sabi ni Sandra, one-time payment lang one time payment lang po. Yes po, one time. One time payment lang po. Okay? All the benefits, ang dami nun, di ba? It's around 20 plus benefits. And it's only a 980 pesos. Mas mahal pa yung sapatos mo. Mas mahal pa yung pang sini mo. Dalawang sini mo, di ba? So... 
coach, nagtuturo rin po ba kayo ng starting business? In Ascending Life, we have a separate course for that. no? But uh, you will only avail of that business or entrepreneurship course if you enroll first sa Savers. Dito sa uh, Ascend Savers. No? You have to enroll first there and we have to assess if you're ready to have a business talaga. Okay? So meron po tayong uh, entrepreneurship course inside the Ascending Life. Okay, so may mga questions ba kayo para masagot ko na, yes, knowledge is the greatest asset. Sabi nga ni Warren Buffett, no, uh, the best investment is in yourself, no, in your knowledge. And uh, one of my mentors, no, si Gary V, yung libro dyan sa taas ito, yung yellow, no, sabi niya nga, uh, the, 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 kumagan, that's why na frustrate siya because people nowadays spend more time upgrading their cell phones, no, their gadgets than upgrading themselves, not their mind. No, I hope na hindi ka ganon. You have invest in yourself, and and of course, there again, there's no risk for you. You just have to, if you want, 15 day money back guarantee. Okay. Yeah, and thank you, Nemi. Download mo na yung free ebook natin. Thank you, thank you. Uh, that's for free. Uh, for the ebook no and of course i hope na if you want to 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 upgrade talaga and go deep in your financial life i hope you enrolled in the ascent savers course okay sabi ni sir Raymond maka invest ba kaya mas kahit malaki utang um i wouldn't invest na mag-invest agad kaya nga ito yung unang tinuro namin no it's about getting out of debt and start your small savings no kasi hindi muna namin tinuro mag-invest kasi madali lang po mag-invest actually basta maayos na yung fundamentals mo yung foundations mo which is getting out of debt and having a savings okay how to balance sabi ni Sandra how to balance your life you have a lot of debts there are many a lot of people kasi who relationships are affected because of that. So, totoo po yan, no? Uh, actually, marami akong natatanggap na ganyan na mga, yung isa maghiwalay na sila ng asawa nila because of utang, no? Uh, hindi, hinihiwalay na siya ng wife niya dahil sa utang. So, basically, kaya ako, ito, kaya we came up with this course, no? Ascending Life Savers course para kasama dyan yung tinuturo namin how to get out of debt. No? Kaya gusto namin... Um, how to balance, no? Have a proper uh, financial coach, have, have a proper, kanina yung sinabi ko sa presentation, di ba? Have a proper money mindset. Ayusin mo yung boy financial, financial mo kasi money is not the most important thing, di ba? We believe in that. But money affects the most important things in life. No? That's why money can affect your relationships. Okay? That's why you need to invest on yourself para at least mas mamanage mo yung pera mo. Okay, so nakakalungkot nga, sabi ko nga kanina, mga tayo, mga Pilipino, we invest more on Lotto, we invest more on Starbucks, or sorry ah, uh, uh, yung mga mga gadgets, no? instead of, katulad for this course, this is only 980 pesos, because we want to help you. No? Sabi na iba, bakit hindi na lang libre, pamigay nyo na. No? Yung e-book, pinamigay na namin libre, yung free, free video training, pinamigay na namin. Pero syempre, di ba, Um, if binigay namin yung mga yan, I'm sure hindi lahat sa inyo babasahin kasi libre. No? Kaya naningil kami ng kahit onte dito sa Savers Course na to para meron kang taya. No? Kung baga meron kang risk. No? Kung baga parang kang merong nilabas para talaga bigyan mo ng importansya itong course na to. Though, maliit lang, 980 pesos. Okay? Yun. Money affects most important things life. Yes, thank you. Uh, sir, always po ako na show mo, like sa FB, I just want to take the opportunity to ask kung pwedeng magpaturo how to start financing company. Um, again, I would, kasi medyo complicated yung tanong mo, no? uh, you can message me or again, if you have extra, just enroll us para may financial coach ka. Enroll inside Ascending Life. Okay. Okay, so guys, thank you. So I hope na uh, makita ko kayo inside Ascending Life Savers Course. Uh, hi, Eileen. 
again if you're uh, watching it in replay no so mamaya may recording naman to if you're late you can go always go back no at the start and um pwede mong i-replay tong video na to and if you are watching in replay no i hope there's uh, still available slots for you again uh, pag nag-enroll ka make sure na mag-book agad ng one-on-one -on -one coaching para makausap mo na yung financial coach at para mag-guide ka and may free assessment din yan no okay Okay, good night guys. Good night. Thank you. Thank you for being with me tonight. And again, please do <laughs> e hearts so mag heart sign gate and, and please do me a favor, no? Please uh share, no? Um share our um itong video, itong Facebook live natin. And I hope to see you inside. I hope to see you inside our uh, ascending life course, no? Again, thank you. Thank you, Ms. Nemi. Thank you, Alexi. Thank you. Weekly, nandiyan po kayo. Thank you. Maraming salamat. Okay? Um, thank you po, Sandra. Yan. Thank you, guys. I hope may natutunan kayo, no, the top six problems. Bakit di makapag-ipon ng mga Pilipino? Yan yung topic natin for uh, ngayong gabi, no? I hope may natutunan kayo. And, again, thank you. Please do. Again, this, and yan yung link naman for the free ebook. No, kung di mo pa na-download, please do so. Yan yung regalo ko sa'yo. bit.ly slash ascend free ebook. That's a 50-page sobrang haba na libro. Kaya, download mo na yan. That's for free. And I hope na makasama ka din, no? Again, inside and savers, no? I hope na makasama kita sa loob ng ating uh, learning platform sa ating university. Again, uh, limited slots and of course the bonuses are for a limited time. Okay, thank you Jan. Thank you. Thank you Vince. God bless. See you next week. God bless. Bye-bye. Thank you Nelly.